Today we'll look at how to find free body loads on a flange. Here we have a flange that's bolted together. There's bolt preload and contact between the flanges. We have one end fixed and we have a tensile load on the other end. We'll begin by defining where we'd like to take our free body cut in order to determine our loads. So here I'll just do that by uh, selecting a box of elements where we'd like to make our section cut. And I'll create a group of those elements. So now that we've got that group, we can show only that group of elements so that now we can see our loads on that face. Then to sum them up, we can take a free body result of those elements and those nodes on that feature face as well. And then pick a location to sum the moments about. You can choose a coordinate system. And let's go ahead and print the information as well. You can put that output in whatever units we'd like as well. So here you can see that information on the coordinate system as well as printed out here. And for our force in the Z direction, you can see that 10,000 pound tensile load that I had put on the model right there. And we can also see the moments uh, about the x-axis there, the bending moments on the flange. Thank you.